everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Samantha and I'm back with a brand new video. Sephora sale is back in April and if you guys love beauty, you know that this is a great time to get a good deal at items that you love at Sephora for a little bit of a discount. Back with eight of my must-have beauty products that you need to add to your cart during the sale. If you guys follow my Get Ready With Me videos or my Spill The Tea series, I use a lot of makeup, you guys. I love Sephora and I love trying and testing new beauty products. I also get sent quite a bit of beauty products as well. Some I absolutely love. They're my holy grail now in my skincare routine or my makeup routine. And some I'm like, mm, I prefer something else. The NARS Light Reflecting Foundation is incredible. So I had first tried this out for my wedding last year. And I think I shared this in like one of my Spill the Tea episodes, but basically before this, I was using a different foundation. It's the Estee Lauder foundation, which I also love, but it's just different. Like the Estee Lauder foundation is a little bit thicker. It sits on a little bit heavier, although not too heavy, but just heavier. So for my wedding day, I want it to just feel light and airy. I didn't want to feel Basically, in a nutshell, I want it to feel like my foundation was my second skin. And that I think is the best way that I can describe the NARS foundation is that it's like second skin. It is so, so lightweight. And I kid you not, like go get it, add it to cart, try it out, and then tell me I'm wrong because I'm not. Use maybe like a tiny little amount and it, you get full coverage. It is so great. It looks so natural. And yes, I'm actually almost out. Like I have. I'm like scraping the, the bottle, but I will be adding this to cart during the sale. Number two on my must-have beauty list, it is from Makeup by Mario. You've also seen this a gazillion times in my Spill the Tea episodes when I do my makeup, but this is a contour stick from Makeup by Mario. It is in the shade Light. It is called the Soft Sculpt. Soft Sculpt. Soft it is great. I think it's such a great value for money too because it goes on and blends so nicely. I'm actually wearing it right now and it comes with a brush, a contour brush. So essentially you're paying not just for the contour stick but you're also getting a brush which is I think a great deal. Next up if you like concealer and you don't mind being a little bit bougie, I definitely recommend the Dior concealer. This is the Backstage Flash Perfector Concealer. I'm in the shade, I don't know, 1W. And this is a little bit lighter than my regular shade. And the reason for that is that I don't usually wear a concealer to conceal blemishes or anything, but I use this to brighten up my under eye. So I really like this. I put a little bit just under my eye and then just to lift it a tad. I also use this for the first time on my wedding day. And so I'm a huge fan. It's lasted a long time. If you want a really great concealer, I definitely recommend. Products I had first tried for my wedding day. And so I can safely say that I'm addicted to them. The next one, it is this stunning Dior eyeshadow palette. I it is the 5 Couture palette in the 649 shade. So I'll open this up so you can actually see the shades that you get. It They're all generally pretty neutral, very wearable on the day to day. And it's something that was not too in your face because I like to do a little bit of a smoky eye to like brighten up my eyes. And I was just in love with this one. Oh my God, this one shade down here because it was so soft and it just, it made the entire look. So definitely recommend, really like it. It is quite pricey, but that's why you get it during the sale. And it is worth the money, you guys. When I was looking for a different eyeshadow palette for the wedding, I was looking through the reviews and someone had said that the, the formula feels like silk when you put on your skin and I'm like, <laughs> Who's paying you to say this? But no, she is correct. I can attest that when you put it on, it does indeed feel very silky. So yes, go and try it in Sephora and then yeah, just test it out. Cause like in Sephora, you can always buy stuff and then test it out and if it just doesn't work for you, you can return it, which is great. So do that. The banana bread easy bake powder, again, tried it out loved it. I didn't even know what baking was. I watched a ton of TikToks that showed me how to use this properly, but a great alternative, I think, to powder if you're going for more of a glam look. I generally put it to like snatch up the jawline as well as the under eye to brighten it up a little bit, but I really like the shade 
It works really great for my skin tone and also is really lightweight. So I place it on and then I just dust it off and it looks so, so natural. We have three products from Lancome and I just, I love it. I want to give you guys options too. Mascara. I have two mascaras from Lancome that I've tried. The first one is a very popular mascara. You've probably seen it on a ton of YouTube channels and TikTok, Instagram, etc. because it is so popular. I can't say it. Idol, Idole. It's, it's this mascara. You've definitely seen it in store or like some YouTuber that you watch has used this before and just raved about it. It is a great mascara. It is pricey. But again, if you're looking for a good mascara and my lashes are not like, I don't know if you can see, but they're not super long either. I think this is a great mascara if you want to splurge a little bit, if you have a special event coming up or a wedding or you know, you're traveling, I think this is a great, great mascara. The only thing, okay, wait, backtrack. It comes, I think there's a waterproof option to this as well. And then a non-waterproof. I think this one is non-waterproof. Yes, but the only contender, in my opinion, to this mascara is again from Lancome, the Hypnose Mascara. I actually like Hypnose a lot more than Dole <laughs> because I think for me, at least for my lashes, it works much better at creating the length as well as the like it just looks really good i don't know how else to describe it but this mascara for my lashes looks really really good and it does a really good job at creating the length and the width that i would like it's so nice and try both to see what you like more but i like hypnos versus idol they're both great though a new product that actually came in the mail so i have minimal experience with it but i did try it out a little bit and i really like it it's from lancome again it's the lancome tint and it, this is in the shade 01 look at how pretty it is so you can apply this on your cheekbones you can apply it as like an eyeshadow and i'm actually thinking of testing this out by applying it on the collarbone to add that extra shimmer, kind of like a bronzer, because it's kind of in that nice bronzy shade. It's super pretty. So I have been using this a little bit. I got this a few days ago, just on as a highlighter, so nice. But yeah, I have not tested it yet, but I think it would look really nice on the collarbone as well. Hey, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and my beauty recommendations. I will add all the links to this, as well as all the makeup that I'm currently wearing down below, because most of my makeup it is from Sephora. I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and I film videos here on YouTube every single week. So I will see you in the next one.